Hi, I'm Peter Heller, I'm a writer. Recently, I was in the Killing Cove in Taiji, Japan, where over 2,300 dolphins, porpoises, and small whales are herded in every year and killed. They're slashed open with knives and spears and left to bleed out, thrashing in the shallows. Often their babies swim around them and they take a long time to die. The meat is sold in supermarkets and school programs and is highly toxic with mercury. I paddled into the cove on a surfboard with five other celebrity surfers and activists in a bid to try and raise awareness about what's going on there. Hayden Panettiere, the star of Heroes, was with us, and Dave Rastovich, the famous soul surfer from Australia. Sometime earlier, I was on board the eco-pirate ship, the Farley Moat, on its campaign to Antarctica to hunt down the Japanese whaling fleet and disable it. The ship is painted all black. It flies under a Jolly Roger. And two days south of Tasmania, heading for the Antarctic ice edge, the engineers came on deck and welded a giant blade to the bow, called the can opener. I realized then that the trip was serious business. The Sea Shepherd Conservation Society, which runs the ship, lays claim to sinking at least nine whaling boats to the bottom of the sea. They were out to get the Japanese, and you couldn't have made up the stuff that happened on this journey. The crew is made up of earth-first activists, former military, professional gamblers, Hollywood producers, and PhDs. It was wild. I wrote a book about the trip. It's called The Whale Warriors. I'm told it's a nail biter and really fun to read, and it's full of information about these issues. In Taiji, I was on assignment for Men's Journal magazine. For more information, check out savejapandolphins.org. For more information on an upcoming movie by the Oceanic Preservation Society, check out opsociety.org. Or go to my website, peterhellerbooks.com, for more links.